News this morning is in the East Bay, Oakland specifically, where one person is dead this morning and several others injured when a party bus was sprayed with bullets. Happened in Oakland. Crown Force Sarah Stinson is live outside. And you've seen the bus, Sarah. Half of the, that side where it was shot up is just gone. Daria, not only have I seen the bus, now it's light out and we can really get a good look. You can actually see all of the bullet holes in the party bus and it is at least, I'm talking at least, two dozen bullet holes that are scattered all across this party bus and it's parked here in front of the Eastmont Station of Oakland Police because that's where the driver took it after the shots rang out looking for help. This party bus was shot at multiple times, as you can see, driving on 580 in Oakland, full of people selling celebrating a birthday. At least one person killed, multiple people shot and rushed to the hospital. The bus is now parked here as CHP investigates. They pulled in here. They, apparently there was about a lot of young adults on this bus and around 1230 in the morning, that's when shots rang out. Police are currently surrounding this party bus and they're trying to figure out how this happened and why. There are multiple scenes to this shooting surrounding the police station right next to the Eastmont Town center and where the bus was shot at on eastbound 580 near MacArthur exit. Family members on scene told our crews it was a 21st birthday party and the birthday girl was shot in the leg. This has not been confirmed by police. That is just what family members told our camera crews on scene. CHP is leading this investigation because it did happen on 580 even though it ended here at the police department. Family members watched as the coroner removed the victim's body. And let me tell you, this is one of the most emotional scenes I have ever been on in my entire career. It's horrific. You can only imagine, you know, you send your young adults off to celebrate a birthday and it ends with at least one person dying and others suffering from gunshot wounds. The coroner has left the scene and now it's the investigation that just continues. A very active and ongoing scene here. We are just minutes away from finally hearing from CHP. I'm told they have someone coming out to talk to the media where they'll finally give us more details. I'm just hoping We'll hear something about the shooter. Hopefully this gunman's just not out there on the loose because these family members, they need at least some kind of good news after this horrific long, long night and into the morning. I'll send it back to you now in the studio as we wait for that information. A couple of things obviously we're going to want to know is do they think it was targeted, but yeah. also just from the looks of that bus and the bullets, there's no way that that was just a pistol. I mean, this thing is traveling. You're going to have to talk to the cops about investigating what kind of... It Weapons. must have been an automatic, you know, machine gun style thing, an automatic rifle. Right. Just the sheer number of bullet holes, Sarah. That is exactly right. I mean, it tells us a lot about what kind of weapon this may have been. And it's just insane to see with this daylight how many bullets went into this party bus. It is actually a miracle that yeah. any sur survived it. Because you think about it, these bullets are going from top to bottom right. into right. this party bus while you're driving. No one was expecting this. Oh, it yeah. is. Yeah so awful to think about it's that's incredible damage and they must have just horrible stories to tell it's a, it's amazing as you said mm -hmm. um you know one person was killed and the others injured and that it may be worse yet we have to find out about the injuries Absolutely. too and how severe they are all right so we're going to stay in uh, real close contact here as soon as the chp looks like they're about to give you some more information let us know we'll come back for the update thank you and I